Okay, um, in year 2000, 2001, na-diagnose po ako ng breast cancer. Stage 2, right breast. Um, nakikita niyo buo na ulit. Pinabayan ako na yan. <laughs> <laughs> and um, in 2001, uh, stage 2 ko, I had to remove a large part of my right breast kasi nandun yung tumor. And sinabi ko sa akin na cancerous siya. And the immunity ng white blood cells sa katawan ng tao is between 15 and 20,000. Ang akin po, bumagsak ng negative. As in, walang-wala na. Ubos. Um, in fact, so much so na kapag may pumasok na nurse na may sipon or nanggaling sa isang restaurant na meron siyang hinawakan na bagay na may virus or whatever, pwedeng ipasa sa akin, for sure I'll die. It was that bad, my, my immune system. Naka-reverse isolation po ako sa hospital, uh, which means nakabubble. Yung kama ko, naka-plastic siya. So, bawal kahit anong virus na makapasok po dun sa room ko. Kasi my health was so detrimental na even somebody na kakatawa man, na nagkulangot sa labas at pumasok sa kwarto ko, pwede na akong hawaan ng whatever virus at pamatay ako. It was during that time that I begged my doctor to allow me to have a laptop. So, and that's where I started to research for myself, what is cancer? How can I help my immune system? Lahat na kinukomplain ko sa doctor, alam niyo, pag nagkikimo kayo, may 100 problems that come with it. Sabi nila, chemo is supposed to cure your cancer. But they don't tell you that it kills your immunity. Okay? 100%. They don't tell you that one of the major side effects is pounding headaches every day. So, di ba habang nagagamot ka for your cancer, binibigyan ka mo ng ibang mga problema. So, pag nag-complain ako ng masakit na masakit ang ulo ko na para akong may migraine, magdadala ulit another gamot. Na yung another gamot naman na yun, nakakasuka. So, the whole day, nagsusuka ka. Okay, tapos bibigyan ka naman another medicine to cover naman din pagsusuka. So, ano siya? Para siyang domino effect. Until I, I really thought, there has to be a natural way. Kasi puro gamot, puro pharma ang binibigay sa akin. Eventually, ang naisip ko, my God, magsasuffer sobra yung liver ko and my kidneys. Puro gamot, puro gamot ang binibigay. How will, how will I be able to heal even if I overcome cancer? Okay? What about the rest of my body? What about my kidneys and my liver and my heart? which has gone through so much that, that's when I started to do other research online. How to boost your immunity naturally. And you know, honestly, it's amazing and daming ways na mag-boost ng immunity natin naturally. Sleep is the number one way. You have to rest. Okay? Since sabi nila, uh, the only time your body heals is when you are sleeping. Did you know that? Diba yung isip mo, relax, relax, beach, okay yan, yeah, diba? That doesn't matter. You can relax in the beach. That's enjoyment. That's not healing. Healing is sleeping. It is so important. But there are other ways you can help with products like our barley. Ang daming product na pwede gamitin. But did you know, the number one in the whole world that God created Himself is barley. Yes. I did through my own research and my own uh, my own um, readings. I realized, isa isa malunggay. Wow, tapos ng ano yan? Healing powers yan. Okay, yung um, yung ampalaya. Tapos din ang healing powers yan. Guyabano, wheatgrass, but above them all is barley. Above them all. <laughs> next to barley is wheatgrass. And yet, yung wheatgrass is only half as powerful as barley. Half! So everything else is below that.